Hello YouTube people, it's Grisbe here, and we are back with some more Minecraft Story Mode, Episode 6, uh, Mysterious Portal, or something like that, I can't remember the full name of it. Uh, anyways, so... Where we left off last time is Captain Sparkles was falling backwards, we don't know why yet. We had just revealed that whoever this host is is probably after the flint and steel that we currently have. One person has died so far named Tork Dog. everyone hate him in any way, so apparently no big loss. <laughs> I'm terrible, I, I, I sound like a terrible person. So as you notice the screen looks slightly different from where we left off, because last time I did have to exit, I did have to play back a little bit more, but I remembered every single choice I did. Play it back exactly, and we're back to where we're at. So let's get into this because I'm excited to see what happens. And if Captain Sparkles dies right now, I'm done. I I, I might just quit. I might be done. All right, let's go. Ah, oh God, he did fall into a hole. Greetings, adventurers. I. And the white pumpkin. One of you is the <gasps> treasure I desire. I will not rest until it is mine. Even if I have to resort to murder. Oh, pumpkin, oh, pumpkin. Oh, pumpkin. Oh, I'm too cute to die. He already killed Sparkles. God damn it. So they we can kill sparkles. him too. They killed Sparkles. No, 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 what's going on? No, no, no. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hang on. Hang on. This is awful. Terrible! Who was that guy? And there's no white pumpkins. Take that to one of the white pumpkins. His hair changed again. Uh, uh, uh. I don't like it. I really don't like it. The white pumpkin is our host. That's the host? Well, I'm not sticking around to see how the rest of this party I know, goes. I don't want to either. Okay, I just gotta check something, guys. I'll be right back. Uh. Alright, guys, sorry about that. We're back. <gasps> Save the cat. Why would you do that? <gasps> And it's a trap and you're dead next, aren't you? So much for a nice dinner party. We knew it would be a trap. I don't like the sound of that. Did she die or did someone else die? Oh. Well, yeah, there's a lot of zombies out there. Flip the lever, flip the lever. Shut Cat, the get door, in. Shut the door! Lever, lever, lever was on the right side. Bullet. Oh, thank God. They can't get their iron doors. Don't be scared. Poor cat. So we're stuck in here. And if we're stuck in here, we're all doomed. Not necessarily. I God. thought I heard Sparkle say something about a flint and steel. Oh, please don't bring that up again. Well, obviously Talk Dog didn't steal it. Okay, but who then? Uh, Jesse? No! It's real! I was hoping there wouldn't be an X. It's well, real. I guess I'm next then. Nope. Not happening. Don't worry, Ivor. I'll protect you. I'll do my best. Appreciate that, Jesse. I just hope that this white pumpkin isn't beyond both of our abilities. Well, that I'm sure true. there's a perfectly logical explanation for how the white pumpkin is doing all this. Traps? I mean... The whole place has got to be rigged with traps, right? Torque dog, trap. Sparkles, trap. Yeah, we need to find out what makes these traps tick. Shouldn't have killed them. I wouldn't care as much about anyone else, but they killed Sparkles, so you know what? Screw you. Mer Telltale Games, screw you. All right, I'm going to investigate that dining room. Cool. I'll keep those guys in the hall for now so I can keep an eye on everyone. An excellent idea. Don't want them messing up the crime scene. I'm sticking with you, Jesse. Doesn't seem safe to wander off alone. No, okay, duh. people, clear out! This is a crime scene! That seems terrible. Okay. How are you doing this, white pumpkin? A lot of pistons. At the fireplace, because that's the first thing we saw. So why not look at the fireplace? Impressive. Anything? Nah. Looks like a regular old fireplace. Until you find that secret hidden button. Ah, huh. well, I guess it's just a little box instead of carpet. 
Okay, there's a So bunch this of... was the dining table where we were all gathered together right before... There's a button. I'll press in a second. This looks like the exact spot where the white pumpkin appeared. But now, just a portrait. Unless... That button. Man, poor sparkles. Crushed under sand. Oh, really nasty way to go. I don't think they're as upset because I'm hoping, dear God, I'm hoping they actually do respond to this and we'll see sparkles again. How you holding up? You mean after seeing a guy get crushed under a ton of sand? Yeah, I'm definitely a little shaken up. We need to figure Maybe. out who's doing this and you how. Say about where we can well, find him again. I think they open. actually die. I'm sure we'll be able to figure it out. Sounds good to me. We want to check everywhere else before pressing that button. Because, you know, it's always good because you never know what you're going to find. Okay, button pressing time. Push the button, push the button, push, push. Push, 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 push. I just want to push okay. the button. Let's give this a shot. Just like before. So who is sitting there? I am it's the white recorded. pumpkin. Yep. One of Just like the treasure I desire, and I will not rest until it is mine, even if I have to resort to murder. Okay, so it's, that's just a statue. It's just a costume on an armor stand with a jukebox for a voice. No sign of how it was triggered. Had to do with wow. that button. The white pumpkin must have some amazing redstone skills to rig up something like this. But why? It's not it must have taken a lot died. of work to rig up. I think it was to scare us. A warning. Well, I better have mission it accomplished. Jesse! He's back! The white pumpkin's back! Don't worry, everyone. It's just a dummy. A white pumpkin costume on an armor stand. Wait, what? Why? The trap that killed Sparkle. His hair is changing again. Was the white pumpkin. It was all triggered by a button on the table. Why is this hair mean? always changing? I am so creeped out right now. Understandably. It means that the white pumpkin sat at this very table and pushed the button. Wait, so you're saying that the white pumpkin is one of us? Yep, unfortunately. That's right, Mr. Stampy. One of us is a murderer. She seems so proud of that. <laughs> that Dramatic right? lightning. Yeah. Wait, but that's not where Jesse found the button before. There's more than one? I'll see if I can find all of them. Oh, God. Nice work, yes, I must say I'm relieved to know that there's a logical explanation for what the White Pumpkin's been doing. So what now? Feels like we've made some good progress so far, though, right? Once we get everyone calmed down, we need to keep looking for clues. So far, we've found those tipped arrows and these traps, meaning that the White Pumpkin is a great brewer and a redstone expert. Yeah. Okay, that's all of them. If you could all please take the same seat you were at before. Four of your seats are marked. These are the seats that had a button to activate the trap. That means that the white pumpkin could only be Dan, Stampy, Lizzie, or Lucas. Wait, you're accusing us? Wait, what? I echo their sentiments exactly. I didn't even see a button. Me neither. Hey, would you people all just calm down? Calm? Listen to this, talking about calm. I'm taking charge now. And I'm going to get to the bottom of this. I, I have the armor separated. on. You can't hurt me. I'm going to talk to each suspect one by one so I can find out who's telling the truth and who's lying. She I've got a looks whole nervous. Lot of questions, and I want nice little matching answers for each and every one of them. Understand me? Loud and clear. Yes, crystal clear. Who are you going to interrogate first? Um, Stampy. Stampy Cat. I love how she just drags him instead of just letting him come and meet me. I think it's the Carrie Rose. I feel like there's something hidden behind it. Jesse, I'm telling you, this is just crazy. Absolutely crazy. Total misunderstanding. Well then. 
I don't even want that flint and steel thingy. Not um, as much as the others at any rate. Did wow. I hear someone saying that it has something to do with portals? I don't have any interest in portals. No, sir. Not for old Mr. Stampy Cat, thank you. It's me, Stampy! Everyone's friend! I gotta say, Stampy, you seem nervous. Everything okay? You comfortable? Um, <laughs> what? No, I'm not nervous. No, totally comfortable. I could fall asleep right here, right now. I'm that comfortable, honestly. Oh, God. Please Stampy. just tell me what you want to know. God, Stampy, you're ridiculous. What do you know about redstone? What's your skill level with the stuff? Oh, well, you know, about average? Average level? Moderate? I, I don't know how these things are graded these days. I know that Dan's been getting really into the stuff lately, though. Oh. Just putting that out there, in case you're curious. Dan's interested in redstone, huh? Know anything about this? Oh, wow! What is that? Some sort of magic arrow? No, I've never seen anything like it before. Honest. You know who would love to see something like that, though? Lizzie. She's wild about potions and brewing and all of that. She's way better with that stuff than I am. Good with potions, you Stampy. say? Very good. Could probably even teach a class. <laughs> and you probably took that class. You know who seems to be okay, quite good at around. this stuff? Who do you think took the flint and steel? I don't think it was ever actually stolen. Oh? Yeah, so Dan got it ahead of Lizzie, right? And she was pretty angry about it. I think he made up that story about it being stolen, so she'd think he didn't have it anymore. Classic Dan move. So someone had the fine steel? You're excused, Stampy. Thank you for your time. Oh, thank time goodness. This room's making me very nervous. Who's up next? Let's bring in Lizzie. Can you bring in Lizzie? Right. Dang, I am just like bad a badass detective. Like, even the way I stand. Jesse, listen. There's been a lot of talk thrown around today. I don't know what people have told you. I don't know what you believe. But I'll just admit it. I want that enchanted flint and steel as much as anyone. Probably more than any of them. I've been searching for it for years. Do you know how much it stung to have Dan, Dan, swoop in and take it from under my nose? So aggravating. Hang on. I thought you said you found it. Well, I as good as found it. I did the research, I did the studying, I was all prepared to go in there and finally get it when that little goggle-wearing goon swept in and stole it first. Ooh. Listen, I just want to get out of here and get on with my day. What do you have to hear to be convinced that the white pumpkin isn't me? You like using redstone? Ever make traps with the stuff? I'm fine, I guess. Lights, doors, that sort of thing. Dan was always way better than I was, though. You wouldn't believe some of the stuff I've seen that guy build. Crazy conveyor belts, hopper systems. I wish I could be that good at redstone. Traps Redstone's. would be no problem for him. Know what this is? Tipped arrow. Kind of shoddy work, though. Definitely not one of mine, if that's what you're wondering. Some noob made that thing. Wow, Seems some like noob. Seems like something Dan might cobble together, though. Plus, I taught Cassie and Stacy how to make those a while back. I'm just gonna be straight. Who do you think stole the flint and steel? Well, it wasn't me, if you're curious. If I had an enchanted flint and steel, I'd be off exploring some other world Like how I am! Between ha -ha. you and me, though, I think Dan's whole story about it being stolen from him is a load of trash. I bet he's still got it. Thanks for your time, Lizzie. So That's there's more now. than one? Flint and steel? Ready for Dan? One in every yeah. world, probably. Send him in. His hair has hey, changed I, again! I don't know what the other's been saying, but you, you have to listen. No, I'm actually, I'm telling I don't. you, you've got the wrong guy. Honest. I would never hurt anyone. You've got to believe me. If anyone's been wronged here, it's me. That enchanted flint and steel everyone's talking about? I found that. That's mine. At least it was before someone stole it. And now everything's gone completely crazy. People getting caught in horrible traps, everyone accusing and blaming each other. Wow, this flint and steel means a lot to you, doesn't it? You don't get it. Lizzie and I have been chasing each other to get that thing for years. And now people are dying because of it? 
I just want you to know the truth. I'm not the White Pumpkin. You've got to believe me. What can I tell you to convince you? So, how would you rate your Redstone knowledge? Me? Oof, not much. Not really my scene. Oh. You want to know more about that stuff? You should ask Stampy. He was the Triblock champion. Know anything about this? Oh, wow. Uh, no, I've never seen anything like that before. No? Tipped arrows not ringing a bell? Made using potions. Nuh-uh, but you want to know about stuff with potions? I've asked Lizzie. She's way better with that stuff than I am. I always go to her with potion questions. Noted. Out with it! Who stole the flint and steel? I... I, I don't know. I don't know anything about it. And you just expect me to believe that? Seems to me that your name's been coming up connected to that flint and steel a lot today. Just come clean with me. You're the white pumpkin, aren't you? Whoa, 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 whoa. No way. Not me. That's just not true. You have to believe me. I shall be kissing you. flint and steel back, and you built this whole house to get it. I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't know how. Honest. You can go now, Dan. Thanks, Jesse. Thank you. Oh, come on! This is nuts! You had a button, too! Fair's fair. It's your buddy's turn next. Alright. Here as much. Hey, Jesse. Ah, my final suspect. Here to point more fingers and blame more people, I'm sure. I didn't push the button, you know. I figured. Thanks, though. How's it been going in here? It is just non-stop whispering and rumors out there. Me, Petra, and Ivor pretty much been sticking to ourselves. So hard to say. I mean, the way they keep throwing each other on the minecart tracks, it's like they're all guilty. They really are. Well, if there's one person who can untangle it, it's you. I hope so. <laughs> Thanks, Lucas. I shouldn't have blamed Dan, though, right away. I should have waited. That was my mistake. Come on, suspect. It's time to return to the others. If it actually is Lucas, then... Oh, my God. How would he have So? Have you decided? Yes. Who do you think the white pumpkin really is? Now, hang on, hang on, everyone. First of all, I want to thank everyone for answering my questions. There's still not 100% proof of anyone, but... But... Yes. Where are your suspicions leaning, Jesse? Jesse was definitely questioning Stampy the longest. What? No! Dan was in there way longer. Hey, not cool. Guys, guys, come on. I actually don't think there's evidence enough to accuse anyone yet. What? Yeah, that seems surprising. I'm sorry, but I don't want to accuse anyone unless I'm 100% sure. And I'm not. Wow. Way to take a bold stance, Jesse. Well, I, for one, am not comfortable being surrounded by possible killers. So if you'll excuse me, I'm going to barricade myself in the library for my own safety. Fine. Suit yourself. Yeah, I'm more in the safety and numbers camp myself. <laughs> well, that was certainly some excitement. Yeah. No kidding. I don't think anyone. The White Pumpkin want. is still roaming around, though. He might be trying to set up more traps. We need to figure out how these things work. Like, we know that the Sparkles trap was triggered by those buttons under the table, but what about the trap that turned Torque Dog into a pincushion? If we figure out how these things work, we might be able to find more proof about who the White Pumpkin is, how they're operating. However, the White Pumpkin did it. He must have done it from the kitchen. Yes. Seems like it might be worth our while I'm to like really around quiet the just to listen to this. You guys go on ahead. I'm gonna stay here, keep an eye on these other people. I don't want them trying anything when we're not looking. Thanks, Lucas. I think Petra should stay too, because I'm starting to become Back in the kitchen. Of Lucas. So, but how would he get there? Exactly. Buttons like back in the dining room? This whole house could be full of traps. I just want to make sure this place is safe before someone else gets hurt. An excellent plan. Huh. I wonder where Torque Dog's stuff went when it got sucked Probably away. Some sort of hopper and and Sparkle's stuff, for that matter. Did that his stuff drop back down? Just gonna do a quick look around. These ovens have been busy since we got here. Who needs that much food? Who says there's food in it? Something to do with the paint. <gasps> There's eye holes in it. Does this painting have 
eye holes? Oh, yeah. How did I not notice that before? No, Seems worth taking a closer inspection. Oh! Just enough for someone to stand in and watch. It's some sort of secret passageway. Very clever. The lever. Everyone get in. What do you suppose book. that lever does? Okay, everyone. Make sure you're nowhere near that arrow trap. More of those potion-covered arrows. Nasty. Well, seems like we found out how the white pumpkin killed Torktor. Another trap. Yeah, and how he's getting around the house. I assume we're investigating the creepy passageway? I think we've of come course. too far to turn around now. Of course. Why well, would we not? After you, then. It's almost weird that Ivor's our friend now. I hope Dan's okay locked up in the library. We could have put them in even bigger danger. I sure hope not. What if there are more traps in there? Unless Dan is the White Pumpkin. In that case, we're just keeping everyone else safe. Yeah, I guess. I just hope we find what we're looking for. Like everyone said Dan was the better redstoner. What do you think that is? Another painting. No idea. But look! A lever! <gasps> no! No, no, no. Ivor, no! What do you think I am? Dance! I was just looking at it! Oh, good. Thanks for the vote of confidence, though. Sorry! See anything that this lever might be connected to? Let's find out. It's the library, isn't it? It's the body! <laughs> what do you see? Where are we? It's the library. Oh. Dan, no. I see Dan locked up in there. There's a possibility it might be the dispensary. Lizzie, what are you doing in here? I snuck in past that blonde guy. Lucas, I think. We have to talk. Oh. About what? She I know you pushed the button. What the? what the heck? No, that's not true. You don't have to lie to me, Dan. I know it was an accident. I know you're not the white pumpkin. Oh, thank goodness. That's such a relief. Yeah, oh. it was an accident. And I felt awful about it ever since. Oh, it's such a relief to be able to talk about this. It's been absolutely tearing me up inside. I'm sure. I just... Haven't you learned anything about not pushing buttons? The white oh, pumpkin! Oh, come on. Nothing She's like this has ever happened let's when go. I push yeah, the button. I feel just so awful. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. What? What on earth? Oh, that's bad. He had a backup plan. What's going on? The door's locked, Jesse! Spiders! They're everywhere! Okay, I'll see if I can get in another way. God damn it. They got it. They got it. They got it. I gotta go for it. I'm sorry, guys. No! Lizzie! I made a mistake! I. Sh no! What a shame. Enjoying the party. You son of a bitch. Hey. Oh, you son of a bitch! I'm sorry, Lizzie! That was my fault! No, not a potion of swiftness. That's my cue. Yeah, come on. I'm sorry, Lizzie. Get me, are you okay? I have to break through. <laughs> He's either invisible or swift. God damn it, I knew I made a mistake. Thank <laughs> you. 
killed Lizzie. God damn it! I thought I could protect more people by going after him, though. Oh, that's down. That was down. I died. I, I very much died. Kinda wish I could go back and change that to Lizzie. I don't think Lucas would kill me though. That was down. I thought it was up because you have to go up the stairs. Look out. Ah, soul sand. Oh dear. It soul sand is like makes you the slowest freaking thing you can ever be. No! It's like it went Q all the way around. God damn it. Apparently I'm gonna die a hell of a lot. Oh, I have to do this all over again? Alright. How she did not expect that though, I don't know. She's dead. <sighs> Not Petra. Lucas. No. Uh, Jesse. I know that's. Oh, <gasps> hey. Give me a moment. I'm trying to figure this one out myself. Yeah, so did I. Uh, yeah, I was, and I almost had him until, you know, he took me by surprise and stuck this pumpkin on my head. Well, what's going on in here? No! <gasps> you called the white pumpkin! Grab him, quick! On it! Get out of our way, Jesse. Yeah, it's all out in the open now. You can't defend your friend anymore. Jesse? See? Even Jesse's doubting you now. I am! It's the facts, Jesse. These horrible things only started happening when your group arrived. Well, they were waiting and for now, us. And now, Lizzie has gone too. Sorry, that was my I fault. I say we throw him outside and let nature take its course. Screw what? you. Out outside? Outside? Where all the googlies are? No, googlies. you can't do that. Yeah, uh, I don't know. I still have my suspicions about Lucas, but Jesse did save me. I don't feel right about chucking your friend to the zombies. Hmm. Brave stance. Oh man, I'm so glad you said that. We really are just here to help. Fine. <sighs> Thank you. Don't go celebrating yet. We've still got to do something with you so you're not roaming around freely. What? Like lock me up in a closet or something? There was a closet in the main hall with a lovely metal door. Seems like a perfect place <laughs> to lock someone up. <laughs> Wait, <something. laughs> I was mostly joking. I guess that's fair. But I'm keeping guard because I still don't trust him. I don't trust you either. That cool with everyone? That's not happening unless one of us goes along too. It's fine, Jesse. I'll watch over Lucas. Awesome. Have you Come too. on, Cassie. But don't go getting any funny ideas, oh, wow. blonde guy. This isn't because I like you or anything. No, of course not. Because I don't Quite. know which one to ask. Prisoners aren't supposed to talk. Okay, well, what are we supposed to do now? 
We need to figure out how we're going to clear Lucas's name. And I'd like to do it sooner rather than later. Let's Seems like some of these people are getting a little stir crazy. Somehow, the White Pumpkin was able to escape that room when Lucas chased him into it. We need to figure out how he did that. Sounds like a plan to me. Alright guys, I am going to pause this episode there. Uh, God dang it, Lucas was dressed up and it's making me doubt him even though he's been with us pretty much the whole freaking time. Like, we chased them together, so why would it be him? Why would it be him? Why would I think that? Why did I not defend him? I... D <sighs> I'm making a lot of mistakes, and I am sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not good with quick decisions, but... Anyway, guys, thank you all for watching. Like and subscribe below. Go check out all these fabulous YouTubers. YouTubes, you know, Captain Sparkles, those people who died, and... <sighs> Captain Sparkles died. Anyway guys, thank you all for watching. Like and subscribe below. Go check out everything else. And I'll see you all later. Peace. So